also gold bay chicken belong and we're also gonna need one onion and one um, bell pepper to go on the sticks when we uh, arrange the when we put the meat on the sticks um, also um, make sure that you put your sticks in water for about an hour before you stack them on the meat on the sticks okay, so they don't burn when you put them in the fire so our spices are gonna go in for seasoning this is chicken below i'm gonna put two teaspoons on here i'm also gonna put um old bay seasoning on here as well as salt Uh, half a teaspoon of salt and then we're gonna put our mixture the peanut butter onion garlic ginger is going on top of it we're gonna use it to marinate it in our bell pepper then we're gonna let it sit for about an hour if you're gonna make it if you know you're gonna make it with the um, like say tomorrow you can make it the night off and put it in the fridge to marinate overnight if you don't have time just let it sit for an hour so that it can mari marinate real good and then you can put them on the sticks so here it is taste it and see where your salt is at the salt is good, you leave it alone. If not, add a little bit more. Our kebab powder is gonna go on when it's on the fire. We're gonna sprinkle it on it. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut the onion and the bell pepper that's gonna go on the sticks. And be back to after an hour, you can put it on the sticks. So these are the sizes that you want your green peppers to be and your onion. So we're gonna stack them. You can stack them in three, so you can stack them in four, it doesn't matter. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and put it in. So here it is, your kebabs ready to go on the grill, you can use your indoor or your outdoor grill, doesn't matter. You also need some oil to brush it on and then we're going to use some of my kebab powder to sprinkle on it. Okay. Brush it with oil. And turn it. Brush it with oil again. I'm gonna cover it and let it cook.
time we're gonna take some of the bath powder. And we're going to sprinkle it on our kebab. If you don't have the bath powder, that's okay. You could do without it. If you want, if you want kebab powder, they sell it at the African market or the Asian market. Some more. I'm gonna let it cook for about a minute or two and it should be ready. So that's it. I thank you for watching. I hope you try it. Thank you. Be safe out there and bon appetit.